What is going on guys? It's Justin from the J Media back with another video. So today we'll be switching some stuff up on the Honda S2000. If you guys didn't watch the previous vlog, we picked it up from Long Shop after about two weeks and I am super happy with the results. We do have the new front bumper on, the Voltex Racing front bumper. This is an authentic Voltex race bumper. So expensive, hard to get, long wait time. So whole front end is fresh paint. The new bumper is painted. We also repainted the hood as well as the fenders. Previously, we had slight bacon fenders. The previous owner pulled and rolled it a little bit too aggressively. Now the fenders look all nice and smooth. Uh, so yeah, everything is all nice and fresh. Paint looks immaculate. I uh, also went ahead and swapped out the little fender lights. I don't have the S2000 badges just yet. We have them. Eventually, they'll make its way on the car. But for right now, um, I might be getting the car PPF soon. So yeah, I'm not going to throw those badges on just yet. For today's video, we're doing actually an install in the interior. So I do have quite a few off-the-market stuff in the interior. But we'll be switching it up today. So right now we have the NRG quick release setup as well as the Vertex steering wheel setup. So I love this steering wheel. It is in suede. Uh, my wife actually got this for me a few years back as a birthday present. But we'll be changing it up to a different setup. So with the suede steering wheel over time if you have sweaty palms, you know, suede gets bad. So I constantly wear gloves. So I'm thinking of switching it up to a leather steering wheel. Since it's summertime here, it's too hot to be driving around with gloves. Um, also, we'll be changing to a different steering wheel as well as a different quick release setup. So one last look here. I will be keeping this Vertex steering wheel, if you guys are wondering, not selling it since it's a gift. And we also have the NRG quick release in gold. I'm debating whether I should keep it or sell it. But if you guys are wondering why it's called quick release, it's because just like that, it comes right off. And... You know, same, just put it on, clips right on. Super easy to come on and off. Okay, and you guys must be wondering what steering wheel setup am I going with as well as what quick release setup. So the setup that we're going with today is the Works Bell. I do have the Works Bell tilt hub in my Mitsubishi Lancer show build. This is the Works Bell quick release. And what's really cool is this is the Works Bell and Night Runner International NRI collaboration. I believe there's a hundred or two hundred of these around. So pretty cool. Just came in the mail. Um, all the Night Runner International NRI stickers on here. Pretty cool. Yeah, super awesome. So pretty excited to throw this on. Let's go ahead and unbox it and see how it looks. And it's my first time opening it up as well, so pretty excited to see how it looks. Like I said, here's a little, I believe, authenticity card, warranty card. I've had quick release setups, but I've always went with NRG just because it's a lot cheaper as well as quicker to get. Works well. I have had the tilt hub. I've had two different tilt hub setups, but never the quick release setup from works bell so i'm pretty excited to see how it looks and feels so bam here it is on one side it says works bell on the other side it says night runner international the logo made in japan very nice some bolts i'm gonna switch it out for the gold bolts that we have i think very very nice let's go ahead and throw it on oh and before i throw it on Let's check out what we have in this box. So I mentioned steering wheels. I actually have two steering wheel setups in this box that are not yet on any of my cars. So the first one we have here is a Momo box. So if you guys are wondering what this is, this is the Momo steering wheel, uh, ASM steering wheel from Momo that I picked up when I was in Malaysia. I bought it from Eugene. He has a lot of rare JDM goodies in his shop. So they're super cool. We also have a pretty limited release at van and vertex steering wheel in leather as well. One of 200 made. 
sorry, I should say one of a hundred made in leather. So that's in the box. Our two options, but probably gonna go with the Momo ASM steering wheel setup. All right, let's show you guys what I have here. Pretty excited to be rocking this setup. This is a leather steering wheel, and I've never actually used any Momo steering wheels, uh, but quality Italian leather. Comes with the Momo horn, but I am gonna be rocking the ASM horn because ASM steering wheel, so nice. Also comes with the ASM horn, so we'll definitely make sure to throw that on. Yeah, pretty excited. So I'm super excited to throw on the new ASM steering wheel setup. There's absolutely nothing wrong with the current Vertex setup, but you know, I like to change setups from time to time. So let's go ahead and take it off and then go ahead and throw on the new works bell quick release as well as the new uh, Momo steering wheel that ASM has. Okay, so we have the quick release setup taken out. This is the short hub. So quick release system, steering wheels, they're all universal, but what makes it unique to your car is the short hub. So this is actually a works bell short hub that the previous owner put on. Uh, quite frankly, a lot of the stuff that I got with the car, uh, I wanted it as stock as possible. So we had the stock steering wheel, but the previous owner also gave me this uh, short hub. So yeah, looks great. And uh, it's works well short hub. So let's go ahead and throw it on. We're gonna go ahead and throw on the quick release setup. Again, NRI collaborated with Workspell, so pretty excited to try on this new setup. All right, so even though this piece comes attached, it's actually two pieces, so you wanna go ahead and compress the spring. So this comes right out. So this is the part that goes onto the short hub. And then the other piece right here, this goes onto the back of your steering wheel. So let's go ahead and uh, attach this part first. Okay, and one other thing to note, there are some wires here. So we also were provided this guy right here. So you wanna go ahead and attach it like that. This black wire is your ground. You're gonna connect it right here. For the red one, this is your horn. You wanna go ahead and connect the horn right here. Now that you have your horn wire as well as the ground connected, you wanna go ahead and tuck this in there and put it on. So they also provided the six bolts right here that you're gonna to use to pretty much hold everything in place. Alright, so we have all bolts in, nice and snug. So right now what we're going to do is attach this other piece to the back of the ASM steering wheel. For reference, this is how it looks once it's all done. This is currently the NRG setup on the Vertex steering wheel that I have. This is how it's supposed to look. Okay, and first things first, we're going to go ahead and put on the horn, ASM horn. I know a lot of guys like to switch it out to like a Mugen horn or the NSX horn. So we have that on here like that. Flip it around. And right now what we're going to do is on the back of this horn, you have this little tab. That's for your horn. You're going to make sure to connect the red one to it. All right, and one thing I felt to add, if you are with the mobile steering wheel, there's this uh, little metal ring that comes with it. So you wanna make sure that you have this metal ring on, um, make it flush, and then you're gonna pop your horn in. It's gonna be a little bit tight. Yeah, make sure that's in first before you go ahead and slap it on.
All right, to make things a little easier, I'll recommend having this part on the car. So now that you have it on, like I said, we have the negative wire, the black connected. You want to go ahead and make sure this this metal plate is nice and holes. You can see all the holes and not blocking it like that. And then next, what you want to do is this horn wire, you're going to feed it through the steering wheel to the horn. So let's go in and attach it. Alright, so right now I just went ahead and pretty much tightened down all six bolts on the steering wheel. You're going to make sure they're nice and snug. In the future, I might change it out to maybe different bolts, maybe titanium ones, or leave it the same, I'm not sure yet. But for right now, we'll just go ahead and rock these uh, stainless steel bolts. Doesn't look too bad. So now that everything is nice and snug, I'm going to go ahead and put on the horn. So on the back of the horn, you have this little tab right here. And that's what this red tab is going to go plug into. So let's go ahead and plug it in. Okay, just plug it in like so. And you're going to go ahead and just push it in nice and snug. And there we have it. We have the ASM steering wheel all installed with the Works Bell NRI collaboration short hub. I think it looks great. You want to make sure that your horn works as well, so make sure to press it. So it works good. You're going to make sure everything is nice and snug. Horn is on there. So, yeah, pretty excited. New leather steering wheel setup on the S2000. All right, so we have the new work spell, short hop quick release, as well as the new steering wheel from Momo ASM, all installed in the S2000. I hope you guys like it. Simple video, but I think really ties in nicely with the interior of the S2000. My Vertex steering wheel looks nice, but just want to change a different setup. Plus, with the leather steering wheel, nice and grippy, I don't have to wear gloves. Also notice the red stitching. Definitely matches the seats as well as the floor mats. So interior is slowly coming together. I'm pretty happy with it. And I hope you guys like the S2000 videos. Like I said, I'm super excited to get the car back home. A um, few more installs will be coming for the S2000. I'm waiting on a couple parts. So stay tuned. Hope you guys like it. If you're new to the channel, make sure to leave a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll catch you guys in the next video.